I felt like we wrapped up yesterday in a good spot. We got the elves and the werewolves all taken care of. Right, I rebooted. I was like, why is my background not there? Hang on. Uh, what is this? Borderless game. That. It bugs the snot out of me whenever there's a game that doesn't support full screen borderless. I know you can't enable V-Sync with that on and some places don't like that, but dang it, I like my full screen borderless. I have multiple monitors. All right. So now, since we've dealt with the, the elves and the werewolf situation, it's time to go help out some other poor, helpless clan. And by poor and helpless, I mean, like, I'm probably going to screw things up pretty badly. All right, level 9 mage, specialization 1. What? Oh, I have to unlock these. Okay. Uh, constitution is health. So I'm going to do these two, and then health, and then constitution. All right. Your coercion. Oh, that's what I... <laughs> That's what I've been dumping all my points into. <laughs> all right, survival. Uh, presence of nearby creatures. Uh, basic traps and lures. Feeling. Uh, almost never noticed the theft. All right, so where's the one that lets me friggin... Oh. Or it interrupts their spell casting and may just take more damage can take more damage from an attack before it interrupts their spell casting and gain a bonus to mana region. Okay. Um so I definitely do not see lock picking in this list anywhere. But I'm I I'm gonna max out coercion. I know it's probably stupid, but I'm doing it anyway. Since when it's since when has stupidity ever stopped me from doing anything? Ah, uh, okay. Paralysis. Okay. That's the grease thing. Spell bloom. Astra creates an energizing bloom of magic that grants... We've been over this. I'm not a real gamer. What's up, Invis? I'm barely even a man. It grants anyone nearby friend or foe a bonus to mana... What's with these double-edged sword things? How irritating. I mean, they really shouldn't be near me, but still. Mixer? Today has been the first day that it hasn't actually, like, given me issues for a while. Alright, so I think I'm gonna use- I think I'm gonna go into Spellbloom. Um... Because I have a tendency to kind of like stand back from the enemy anyway. But I definitely need to go to a camp and rest or something. Like, it's getting bad. Alright. Oh. Is Mixer having issues today? Not that their status page will friggin' tell us anything. Oh, everything's just fine! Docker of Shocker. All right, so where's the exit? Ah, computer arch. All right, um, I know that Alistair can level, uh, but I will probably... <laughs> yes, I see you, Invis. So what's the deal with you and him anyway? What are Dare you talking I ask? about? Him? Him who? Is this supposed to mean something to me? You know exactly who I'm talking about, Mr. Let's Make Kissy Faces over there. My, my. You are jealous, aren't you? Did I take your favorite Grey Warden away from you? What? I'm not jealous. I'm horrified. Those blushing cheeks of yours tell a different tale. These blushing cheeks are terrified that you'll suck all the blood are out of them you once you finish if I feel the need to suck on mm -hmm. anything of yours, Alistair, you'll be the first to know. That was so not what I meant. Perhaps we should go and tell him together about your touching concerns. <laughs> Perhaps he'll pay more attention to you if you ask nicely. They uh -huh. I think we're done here. 
done before you started. They disabled FTL by default on mobile uh, viewing. And I don't know exactly why. What is this? Wide open world. Okay. Uh, world map. What the? In fact. Yes. Why? Okay, there we go. Jeez. Where's my camp? That's the Dalish. This is the forest. Oh, party camp. Thank you. A blight. How will you end it? Um. Do I look like I'm here to just solve all your problems, Sten? Uh, let's see. I thought we'd just ask the Darkspawn to please leave. If you hope to slay the Archdemon with wit, you may want to arm yourself first. You say you are a Grey Warden. I have heard stories of this order. Uh, let's see. Uh, wait, you doubt I'm a Warden? Great strategists and peerless warriors. That is what we hear of the Wardens. So far, I am not impressed. Neither is my chat. Well, I'm new to the Wardens. Will you make that excuse to the Archdemon? Or the victims it claims in the meantime? You're being kind of an a-hole right now. Yeah, I disapprove Enchantment? too, Stin. All right. Let's see what Morgan has to say. Yes. Uh, let's see. I'd like to ask you something. If you must. Uh, let's see. Really, what she seems to be. Didn't we ask her all these questions already? I think we did. Yes. Uh, I'd like to discuss something personal. We are in camp, so tis as good a time as any. I don't... Should I go for it? Oh, you can't see my options. I have a feeling if I try to kiss her, she's going to do something unpleasant to me. Really? You won't... Okay, I'll go for it. What's this? <laughs> Tis a rather odd discussion you seem to desire, leaning in so closely. Do you object? Not unless you stop. Oh ho! Morgan approves. All right. Yes. Uh, something We're personal. We're in camp, so tis as good a time as any. Uh, we need to discuss us. Discuss away. Nothing. For no, I'm. I don't kiss her and then break off the relationship. I got what I wanted. Goodbye. Enchantment? Enchantment! Yeah. Uh, Oathkeeper. I'm not certain. Do I have this equipped on anybody? Doesn't tell me. <laughs> Will do. Why? If there's anything I can do for you, please, please tell me. The uh, have you heard any rumors? The dark spawn have attacked Lothering. I don't think everyone even had fled by the time they came either. Word has it they swarmed the entire area, making off with prisoners and burning down the buildings, and then they were gone, just as quick. Oh. I wonder if there's anyone left. I heard some chanters were going to head down south. Maybe to try to find some survivors. I'm not holding out hope myself. That's what I've heard on the road, anyhow. Take it for what it is. Okay. Uh, I should go. Of course. Good fortune to you and yours. Goodbye. Oh, he says something other than enchantment. Enchantment! Yes? How's it going? I'd like to talk. Well, here I am. What would someone like you be doing in Lothring's Chantry? What is meant by someone like me? You know what? I think I'm going to replace Sten with her. Sten's getting on my nerves. Uh, you just don't seem to belong in a cloister. Did you think I was always a cloistered sister? The Chantry provides succor and safe harbor to all who seek it. I chose to stay and become affirmed. Affirmed? 
we affirm our belief in the Maker, in Andraste and the Chant, but other than that, there are no vows taken. Yeah, well, you know, I'm trying not... I'm trying to probe without being accusatory. I suppose that wasn't a great first question to open with. Uh, let's see, and what did you do before that? I was a traveling minstrel in Orlais. Tales and songs were my life. I performed, and they rewarded me with applause and coin. And my skill in battle? Well, you pick up different skills when you travel, yes? Yes, of course. Um, let's move on. Did she just answer her own question? Okay. So where do I go to sleep around here? Oh, that's a neat looking loot, or whatever that is. Uh... Doth I have bedroll round yonder? Is this my tent? What is this? It looks like it's set up for some sweet bike ramps. Uh... Oh, come on! So I can't do anything about these stupid... Hey, Morgan! Are, are you interested in taking this relationship way further? <laughs> yes? Ah! Dang it. Fine. Jeez. Oh! I don't have any injuries right now. It looks like I left. I lost the injuries just by coming to camp at all. That's good. Alistair, what do you need? I'd like to ask you something. Ask away. Uh, let's see. Tell me about the Grey Warriors. So you said you were raised by the Chantry. Oh, did I say that? I meant that dogs raised me. Giant slobbering dogs from the Anderfells. A whole pack of them, in fact. Uh huh. That would explain the smell. Well, it wasn't until I was eight that I discovered you didn't have to lick yourself clean. Old habits die hard, you know. Uh, let's see. That would explain the... I'm keeping this going. This That would explain the breath as well, then. And my table manners, too. Though, come to think of it, they weren't all that different from the other Templars. Or did I dream all of that? <laughs> Funny the dreams you'll have when you sleep on a cold, hard ground, isn't it? Is this going somewhere? You have no sense of humor. You know that. Fine, fine. Have it your way. No, I was trying... Let's see. How do I explain this? I'm a bastard. And before you make any smart comments, I mean the fatherless kind. My mother was a serving girl in Redcliffe Castle who died when I was very young. Our Lehman wasn't my father, but he took me in anyhow and put a roof over my head. He was good to me, and he didn't have to be. I respect the man, and I don't blame him anymore for sending me off to the Chantry once I was old enough. Why did he send you off? Our Lehman eventually married a young woman from Orlais which caused all sorts of problems between him and the king because it was so soon after the war. But he loved her. Anyhow, then you, Arlesa, resented the rumors which pegged me as his bastard. They weren't true, but of course they existed. Bastard. The Arl didn't care, but she did. So off I was packed to the nearest monastery at age ten. Just as well. The Arlesa made sure the castle Make wasn't the home to me go by that away. point. She despised me. Ah, uh, let's see. What an awful thing to do to a child. Maybe. She felt threatened by my presence, I can see that now. I can't say I blame her. She wondered if the rumors were true herself, I bet. I remember I had an amulet with Andraste's holy symbol on it. The only thing I had of my mother's. I was so furious at being sent away, I tore it off and threw it at the wall and it shattered. Bet you regret stupid, that now, don't you? Stupid thing to do. The Arl came by the monastery a few times to see how I was, but I was stubborn. I hated it there, and blamed him for everything. And eventually, he just stopped coming. See, as much as I want to be flippant and choose the humorous answer, like, I need to be careful with these conversations because it's affecting my reputation with my group. And I presume that if I piss any of them off enough, they'll leave me. I don't know whether or not that's true. That's just an assumption I'm going forward with. Yes. Uh, are you sure he isn't your father? Yes, I'm quite sure. At any rate, I don't look anything like him. You'll see for yourself. 
Not that it stopped the room. So that's end. that's like Kotor. All I know is that the Arl is a good man, and well loved by the people. He also was King Kalen's uncle, so he has a personal motivation to see Logain pay for what he did. Anyway, that's really all there is to the story. Okay. Alistair approves. Excellent. Yeah. So I think I think I'm gonna make Leliana replace Sten. Sten's getting on my nerves, and as much as he's a heavy hitter, it just dog food or chocolate pudding. It's dog food. All right, let's go help somebody. Sorry, I don't know what it is about streaming where my nose itches. It, it's driving me crazy. All right. Well, I'm definitely going Alistair, yes. Morgan, Indeed. Liliana. Indeed. I mean, I, I like Sten as a heavy hitter. I just can't stand him as a character. Um, Redcliffe Village. So you had suggested at one point that I try the Frostback Mountains. And it didn't work out for me, so we went and did the elves instead. So I'm going to try and make it back to the Frostback Mountains. And I'm sure I'm going to run into a couple of random encounters along the way. That's a long way to go. How's it going, Dracodai? For real? I, I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down from the Regency. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the Darkspawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a, a solution, with your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. Uh, who you be? An assassin. Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best. Ah, uh, <laughs> that's going to be a and problem. the most expensive. Just get it done. I was like, is, the, is his name actually Severance? <laughs> Alright. So. We got ambushed. I'm going to save. That was one of the things that was screwing with me pretty bad. So I don't have any injuries right now, and my mana is still not going up above 50%. That bothers me. Yep, the bounty hunters, and there's nothing I can say, they just engage me immediately. So, one of these two is a spellcaster, and that's a problem. I'm gonna assume it's that one. That'll deal with it. Alright! Alright, I'm yeah, and now that that chick is down, I can put down a spell bloom without risk. I am your It of course also helps that the game has been set to easy. Oh, you better than that. Oh, lovely. Take them out. Just die already. All right. Yeah. So let me let me go ahead and do. Um, matter of fact, I probably ought to take a look at at uh, Leliana's gear as well. So Alistair. Yeah, I did down. I did bump it down to easy. Like it was. Any time I ran into a situation where um, where uh, I was getting swarmed by like more than six people it was just absolutely wrecking me and it was making me mad so yeah i bumped it down all right um we're gonna do let's 
strength, dexterity, and actually, no, I'm going to do strength and double constitution, so he's got more health. We'll do master combat training. And let's see. Shield wall. Where's shield wall? Bam. Yeah, buddy. I've got uh, I've got a little article up that I think Locke shared with me a few weeks ago about how to how to kind of turn him into a tank and uh, a a good tank. So that's what I'm operating off of. What does she use? Daggers. Okay, that's not as good. That's a long sword. I presume as a as a rogue she could use bows, but I think I'd rather keep her with the daggers. It's this easy mode. Armor. Sorry. Just need a moment. You definitely need some armor. Oh, that's what she, that's what just came. oh I should have sold some crap while I had the chance oh, I completely forgot I've got all this extra crap I don't need no well I mean that's the best I can wait she can hold oh she can do a wield slap that and suck in right there yeah all right and Liliana I'm gonna make you for you dexterity is gonna be important. Hunting constitution to help keep you alive. A bod. Acting as spy as assassins, spies, and saboteurs. Okay. Improved stealing. Yeah, so I, I'm assuming it's improved stealing is the lock picking thing, because I'm not seeing it on hers either. She's definitely a rogue. Rogue. A deadly strike. Prove to. Oh, here's the lock picking. Wait, can I take this back then? Uh, let's go for expert combat training. Do bigger lock picking. Oh, it'll be so nice to actually have a person who can pick locks. Oh, that's been driving me crazy. Nice. Song of Valor. Did she do that? Ooh. Look at all these people. It's almost like a little city. Yep, as long as they can buy my crap, that's all I want. Thank the maker, my brother and his family made it out of Lothering. He said that the Darkspawn attacked it the very next day. The Darkspawn took Lothering, did they? I don't know. I expect so, since there was no one there to stop them. Well, it won't be much longer until those monsters get here. There doesn't seem to be anyone fighting them now. Nope, not a one. Let's see, you don't have a name. Let me ask You're just you this, dwarf. Then, Morgan. What if there really was a Maker? Then I would wonder why he has abandoned his creation. It seems I don't know why my nose is itching so badly right now. He left us because we were determined to make our own way, even if we hurt ourselves. And he could not bear to watch. But how do you know? You cannot ask him this. Perhaps he has gone to a new creation elsewhere and abandoned this as a dismal failure best forgotten. I do not need to know, because I have faith. I believe in him and feel Ooh, his hope you just got and his love. Faith. How quickly those who have no answers invoke that word. How can someone who practices magic have so little capacity to believe in that which he cannot see? Magic is real. I can touch it and command it, and I need no faith for it to fill me up inside. If you were looking for your higher power, there it is. But only if you can control okay. it. Okay. Oh, you wish to talk to me? Truly, it's a courtesy for one so well-armed to notice a lowly merchant. Well, then you better give me good prices, or else you'll no one will never... That was going to be a solid threat, maybe. Someone has to. Trade with other races can dry up. We servicers are up. Orzammar's lifeline. Even if we're denied a cast, the assembly says we've turned our back on the stone. But they still use the goods we bring. Hypocrites. That's not right. Someone should do something. 
Maybe it'll change. Are you making a suggestion? How often do you restock in Orzammar? Twice a year. I'm confined to a trade stall in the commons, but I see enough. It's hey, very you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. My grandfather says I've lost my stone sense. I was born topside. I don't remember having it. Okay. Best of luck to you. Wait, but you're not merchanting anything. Again, I'm flattered by your interest, great lord. Best of luck to you. I want to sell things to you. Bloody dwarves will argue themselves into poverty if they aren't careful. Aren't you a dwarf? Weird. Like he's, it's like she's being racist about her own race. The one who talked about all the werewolves. Surface silts, half price. I want to sell you stuff. What's this? All right. Dagger. Might be good. This is madness. They can't just shut down the city. Evidently they can. They wait too long, trade won't come back. That's the way this works. What's up there, Shepard? Can I interest you in something? I've got the finest selection of previously Please owned armor and weaponry this side of Val Royo. Let me take a look. Why oh, pay crap. through the nose for new equipment when you can buy like new for much, much less? Yeah, where do you get like new armor from? Oh, here and there. Look, that's really not important. The important thing is, it's cheap. And just as good as what you'd find at a smithy. Yeah, that's not suspicious at all. Let me take a look. Oh, of course. And remember, everything's covered by Farin's 24-hour lifetime guarantee. I don't think that word means what you think it means. Uh, let's see. Greater Lyrium Potion Recipe. Don't need it. Don't want it. Let's... Portrait of a Goose Girl. This belt. Plus armor. Back harness. Collars. Alright. Whatever. I'm just... I need to sell some stuff. Oh, this would be good for... What's her face now? Doesn't matter. Don't want it. Spirit Bomb. Nope. 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 Resistance to electricity damage? Nah. I'm not worried too much about about elemental damage types on easy mode. Small grease trap? Nope. Definitely keeping the, the health and mana potions, though. Especially considering how many problems I keep having. Uh, what are these? Oh, these are friggin'... I wish they would show you, like, how much weight is being used. Because sometimes you can pick up something and it doesn't matter towards the weight, and sometimes it does. And I think, Pixel, you told me I can just sell all of the gems. Good. Get rid of that. Already. And I've got all these gifts. Like, I don't know what to do with these gifts. Golden Scythe, 490 black. Blah. Runic Worry token. Okay. Okay. Don't need that. And I think we've already determined we don't need any of these. Oh. Their armor. We already went through all the gear. I'm keeping the Blood Dragon stuff because that's... That I know we're going to use at some point. Bam. 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 Does he sell flasks? I need flasks real bad. Uh... No. So I can't make any potions. But at least I've gotten rid of most of my inventory. Well, half of it. I'm down with that. Demand an art you insult all of Ferelde. King Loghain will not suffer. Vieta, this land is I'm not interested in, in letting you finish talking. Kings. I cannot allow entry at this time. King Loghain demands the allegiance of the Desher, or Lords, or whatever you call them in your assembly. I am his appointed messenger. I don't care if you're the King's Wiper. Orzammar will have none but its own until our throne is settled. 
Okay, uh... Why have your people retreated like this? They hide because they are dwarves. I would challenge any race to fare as well. Our king is dead. Endron I do can return to the stone not three weeks ago. The assembly has gone through a dozen votes without agreeing on a successor. If it is not settled soon, we risk a civil war. Fantastic. Uh, I don't want to just bonk them over the head with the treaty right away. But I might have to. I'm going to try to appeal to, like, right, look. I'm just going to hit them over the head with the treaty. Because if I be like, look, man, the blight's coming. We really need your help. They're going to be like, oh, but our king in the civil war. I'm just going to hit him with the treaty. The wardens killed King Caelan and nearly doomed Ferelden. They're sworn enemies of King Loghain. Well, that is the royal seal. That means only the assembly is authorized to address it. Grey Warden, you may pass. Thank you. You're letting in a traitor? And a foreigner? In the name of King Loghain, I demand that you execute this stain on the honor of Ferelden. I have stained many things, sir. Loghain is the traitor who killed King Caelan at Ostagar. What? L lies and slander! King Loghain will not suffer this. I will not suffer it. I'm his messenger. Kill each other as you will. But take your sodding fight off my doorstep. I'm not the one looking for a fight. Ha! Wait, I'm actually fighting him? Okay. You want to go? Let's go. Let's wipe them out quickly. Oh, oh now you're my problem. Oh, you should run while you can. Oh, going. Too easy. Now this should be fun. Time to play. Right there. Man, these guys have got some health to them. There we go. How about you then? Oh, such a shame. Oh, crap. If you insist. I lost Alistair. Whoops. Was not paying attention. You forced our hand. I should have managed Rain Day. Didn't think about it. Alistair, get up. Ow. My bruises are all bruised now. Aw, oh, poor Alistair. Gonna be okay, dude. Heavy plate armor. Yeah. And I'm off. Uh, can you use it? No. Wow, he doesn't have the strength to even put that on. You weakling! Alright. We took the fight off your doorstep. They're dead. You've done me a service. That fool Imrek was barking for a I'm week. I'm working on it. Are all humans so touched? You are free to enter Orzammar, Grey Warden. Though I don't know what help you will find. Okay. A fair journeys, Warden. Those statues are dwarven paragons, if I remember right. The best bread. of their ancestors. Please, sir. Just a bit of bread. Bread. Spare a few bits for an old man. Oh, I can't even go up there. How did you get in here? Now that's a, a thing of, of beauty, food, daughter. Lord. If you work hard like Branca, all Orzammar will know your name. This does Mother, remind me I of Iron Forge a bit. Don't say that. Not to me, Marga. not to anyone. Now get back to the forge. I want to see more details. And yes. that's female shepherd, I think. May the ancestors look kindly upon you. Show respect, surfacer. You're in the Hall of Heroes, home to the best of us. Um, Let's not insult them by asking who. The figures are quite grand indeed. Paragons, dwarves who achieve such greatness, they're considered ancestors, even if they yet walk among us. I know that, only we had one but I enjoy recognizing voice actors. A voice like that, there would be no dissension. Perhaps we... Perhaps I can help. Perhaps I don't want you to. A surfacer should not see us in this kind of disarray. 
Well, the Goodbye, genie's war. already out of the bottle, oh, dude. Needed. I've already seen what you in that, that dessert. Soup you made for supper last night. Oh, that? That's a traditional Ferelden lamb That's and supposed to be lava? Stew. Do you like it? Oh, so it was lamb Enchantment. Then. It had a certain texture I don't normally associate with lamb. They didn't make lamb and pea stew for you in Lothering? We ate simply there. Going. Oh, I want to listen to their banter back and forth. Because some of it is quite charming. But if I get bored with the banter, I'm moving on. <laughs> It is the assembly who makes a king, and a king who nominates his successor. None of it is carried in the blood. Or as now, when someone tries using the assembly to pull a coup. Who's to say what my father said in his final hours, when the usurper Harrowmont was the only one by his side? I'll have you thrown in prison. You've bitten off more than you can chew. Handlers, separate these dashers in the diamond quarter. I will not have Balin incite a riot. You will not speak that way about the man who should be king! Dude. You've got to slow your Enchantment? roll. Enchantment? Indeed. How's it going, Dustin? So blind, idiots. I won't have fighting in the Enchantment! Comics, especially in front of outsiders. Ah, eh, there's nothing like so there's nothing uh, the bad region. about casual murder. Vieta, surfacer. I'm bid to let you walk the commons, but keep your place. Warden or not, I want order. Don't screw with the, the chief of police. Uh, can a city function like this? See, that's why I don't want you surfacers seeing our worst. You'll think that's all we are. The market is thin, but busy, and the tavern never closes. Bad blood is usually kept to the proving. Should toss Balin and Harrowmont in there. Sort this all out in a hurry. Ooh. Yeah, I, I I get like that sometimes where I leave some trivial task behind. And I just, I, I'm just, I'm not in the mood now. I'll get to it later. And then when I do it later, I'm like, you know, if I just kept up with this when I had the chance, it would be easy. Now it's hard. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, the proving? Personal battles for honor and ancestor. I don't expect a surfacer to understand. If you must be our warden, at least Thanks, know douchebag. us. Go to the Shaper of Memories in the Shaperit, the true bright spot in the Diamond Quarter. Okay. Uh, the Blight is coming and I need Orzammar's assistance. Surface problems. Well, we have no king to hear you. You can join the shouting at the Assembly in the Diamond Quarter if you want. Bunch of Desher lords bickering over sand. Balin, Harrowmont. Is one so different? No paragons here. Paragons? Surfacers appoint no paragons? Truly, you're lost in all that sky. They are the best of us, declared living ancestors. If you must be our warden, at least know us. Go to the Shaper of Memories in the Shaperit, the true bright spot in the Diamond Quarter. Ah, yes, the quest objective they want me to do so badly, they tell me to do it twice. I should get going. Yes, you should. I, and I want to slap you in the face. You're very obnoxious. Wow. So this is Ozama. It's huge. Okay. Ancestors, guard my son, for he is lost in darkness. I'm sorry. Did you have an offering for the ancestors? Although, I can't imagine your ancestors reside in the stone. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? My name is Vilda, widow of Turok of the Smith Cast. I pray here every day for my son, Ruck. I only wish I knew whether I should be asking for his safe return or for the ancestors to accept his soul. He probably wouldn't be in trouble if you'd give him a cooler name. What happened to him? It was five years ago. Ruck. He was only a youngster. He joined a Deep Roads excursion, the only Smith to go with the warriors to repair their arms. He was and so proud. Up. But he got separated somehow. When they came home, he wasn't with them. 
Did anyone go after him? The captains don't want to lose anyone searching for stray men. Too many were taken by Dark Spawn that way. I'm going to volunteer to help, but I really want to answer some of these. Well, your son is surely dead by now. Uh, we shouldn't abandon him. I'll look for him if you want. How? There is no way except I'll, to uh, brave the deep roads yourself. Uh, we're not with the elves anymore. I don't get a chance to holla anymore. Uh, let's see. I'm a Grey Warden. That's what we do. A Warden? So you could do it. Only Wardens face the deep roads without a company packing them. Oh, thank you. The ancestors finally heed my prayers. Please, find me as soon as you return. Okie doke. Back here. Nope, nope. I do not even want to think from what manner of substance a cave-dwelling people would create their spirits. Lava? Probably lava. I once drank a thimble of dwarven ale, woke up a week later in Jada wearing nothing but my shoes and a towel. Oh, I gotta try this mess. Um. Oh, jam. Ugh. Who wants to grab the spirit out of toe jam? Like, like, your 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 like hero spirit shows up and you're like, oh god, oh god, it smells so bad. Go away. Um, I can't take it. Every time the spirits uh, confront me, I, I puke in disgust. Aren't open to everyone. I mean, it's how the ancestors show their favor. Do they really need our help to decide who's worthy? And then he practically slapped me. Lord Helmy, huh? Lord Denik Helmy. Honored Desher of the Orzammar Assembly, and terrible disappointment to my esteemed mother, who doesn't like me spending time in taverns. But you're here You anyway. understand what I'm saying, right? On the surface, there are no casts, and it works fine. Am I right, Warden? Well, I mean, nothing's perfect. Uh... Yeah, you know me? Word travels fast. You don't get far as the youngest and most outspoken member of the assembly without keeping an ear to the stone. I heard there was a Grey Warden in town. No offense, but you kind of stand out. Okay. Your views on caste must be controversial in the assembly. Very good. I guess someone already told you I was good for nothing, drinking my life away at tapsters. Or did they leave off a greatest shame to ever fall upon the assembly? I'm always like that one. You know, most smiths and tavern keeps would make decent dashers if we gave them a chance and a seat in the assembly. Or Zamar is so mired in I tradition, like no one bothers asking if the casts are even necessary. How does the caste system work, anyway? Badly. Oh, <laughs> you're serious? Well, it's simple, <laughs> I guess. The king and elected dashers of the assembly are at the top. Then it's the nobles. Then the warriors and all the craftsmen. At the bottom are servants. The castless and criminals are below even that. Your caste is determined by that of your same-sex parent. And that's where you stay your whole life, whatever your skill. So you get to vote on the next king? Me and 79 other fine, upstanding examples of how someone who's born into every privilege inevitably wants more. They're not fond of my views on equality. Who are you voting for? I doubt either candidate has been outside the diamond quarter in his life. But Lord Harrimont seems a bit more forgiving. So that's Prince the dude Balin's that didn't just casually murder someone outside? Has sin. But I don't think anything in Orzammar matters more to him than winning. Yeah, there it is. I should get going. As you wish. Like, this dude just dumped like a friggin' class on the dwarven system on me. And then I'm like, cool. I got to go. Oh, you guys. Nothing. Oh, Brother Burkle. Maker's blessing on you, brother. 
Uh, may his divine spirit always light your way. Ah, it's a great pleasure to meet a fellow believer. I'm Brother Burkle of the Red Cliff Chantry, returned to my ancestors' land to spread the chant of light. Even in the very bowels of the earth, we hear no end of this chant. And that is something to rejoice in, good sister. I'm petitioning to open a chantry in Orzammar. Don't dwarves worship their ancestors or something? There is resistance. <laughs> it's obvious the world wasn't created by the mortal souls who dwelt within it. Yet the dwarves of Orzammar persist in worshiping their own forefathers. Nothing wrong with us with respecting the achievers of the past. Uh, let's see. That's their religion. You shouldn't interfere. You speak as if these people have deliberately chosen to reject the Maker, but most of them haven't even heard his name. How can they choose the path of enlightenment if they never learn that the path exists? You can tell them if you want, you just can't shove it in their face. Well, good luck with that. Let me know how it... Uh, well, fine. What permission do you need to open a Chantry? The Shaper it controls changes in Orzammar's structure and society. I need the Shaper of Memory's permission to open a prayer meeting. The Shaper of Memories? The Shaper of Memories controls the Shaperit, Orzammar's record system. Like the Chantry's historians, but, but more thorough. And much they track more the births scary. and lineage of every dwarf born in the city, every property oh, sale, I see. death and it's battle, just... marriage, okay. or divorce. When they talked about, like, it, it sounds almost like the Keeper of Memories, like the giver, you know? Like, no one knows the past except you, and it's like... Okay, that's an interesting system, but if someone corrupt ever takes the role, that just means that they can shape history into whatever they see fit. That's not good. Uh, let's see. If I bump into him, I'll be sure to mention it. I can see the Maker's hand on your shoulder, guiding you always. <laughs> if this gentry could help just one person as much as it helped me, it's worth any trouble. Please, let me know as soon as you've heard anything. I found the, the giver to be an interesting story. I enjoy it. Something that kind of makes you put yourself in someone else's shoes and just be like, you know, you live your life this way. What if things were different? You know, empathy is not a bad thing to work on every once in a while. The book is cool. Yeah. The movie, the movie was a, it was an okay shot at it. I'll give it that. All right, I know there's more crap over here. Uh, there's quests over there. <laughs> Nug right. <laughs> yeah. Um. So uh, I'm the I'm the keeper of memories, and uh, what what do you what do you do, Jim? I'm a I'm the Nug Wrangler. <laughs> Nug Wrangler. I've got to meet this guy. Hang on. Please tell me what a Nug Wrangler does. I have to know. I knew I should have stuck to common Nugs. I've gone and lost them too. I'm never finding the way they skitter. Common Nugs? I don't like those. They look dirty. No way I'm going back to that supplier in Dust Town. I guess I'm shutting it down. I recognize him too. I don't know his name, but he was in uh, L.A. Noir and a couple of other things, I think. Very distinctive voice. Uh, let's see. Are these things... <laughs> are they dangerous? I gotta boil them before roasting, but otherwise, no. Safe as sand. Some people swear they make good pets. May as well leash a turnip, I say. If I see any nugs, I'll send them your way. Good on you, stranger. Only need one to turn this around. Mm. Uh, excuse me, I, um, do you have a moment? Uh, sure. You look like you're not from around here. Really? What was your first clue? Oh, wonderful. I've been trying forever to find someone who really <laughs> knows the surface world. I, I don't suppose you've heard of something called the circle? Should we play dumb? No. What? What's the circle? I've never heard of it. 
I totally didn't start the game there. Uh, now... Look, I do enough casual murdering and jerk baggery in Red Dead. Let's be nice. Bring it down. I'm a mage myself. Then I'm truly honored. You should be. I've never met an actual mage. Is it true you can manipulate nature's forces with your mind? Like you were born with lyrium in your veins? I can't even imagine. Are you a fan? Uh, I'm happy to answer any question. This is probably a bad thing to do, but... I've been trying to reach someone there for years. I've sent missives with every caravan, but I never get a reply. I want to know if they would accept me for study. Do you want me to ask them? That would be wonderful. My name is Dagna, daughter of Janar of the Smithcast. Tell them I've already begun reading the Taventer Imperiums for Tikum Kadab, and it's just fascinating. Did you know the Imperial Magister Lords once had genealogies of every human family known to produce a mage child? She's so enthusiastic and adorable. I'm glad we're helping her. <gasps> oh, I'll go pack my bags right now. I'll be waiting by my father's shop. Whoa, 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 whoa. Pump the brakes, girl. Over enthusiastic. Over in the diamond quarter. Proving grounds, dust town, tavern. We've been there. Miss the armors. Miss the imports. This is the deep road. It's where we get into the fights and stuff. I mean, I can appreciate her enthusiasm. But, like, if it were me, I would be like, what makes you think you can be a mage? Have you done any of this before? Like, can anyone just learn it? Like, and then she's like, yeah, I'm going to pack From to leave I've right now. Like, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm almost surprised we haven't seen blood running these streets. We can't. That's a nug. Well, they are kind of cute. And we took it. Greetings. Could the end of Orzammar be nigh? Turn to Lord Harrowman and assure the future of Dwarven society. Isn't Harrowman? No. What's a human doing? Oh, must be the Grey Warden we heard about. Yes, thank you for the casual racism. I really appreciate that. So this is the nice guy, right? No, you're kind of looking like the D-bag. The nice guy had, like, gray hair or something. Even Balin's father rejected him in the Heramont end. Heramont is the rightful king, and you know that. Welcome to Lord Heramont's estate. Welcome to Lord Heramont's estate. Close to Michael Dorn, but not quite. Wow. House Heramont is honored to have you here. And it should be. I'm the bee's knees as it is. All right, time to try this out. I could do that for you. Oh, it's so nice. I don't need any of these, but oh. Where's the tavern? Did <laughs> did my character say that? And I'm off. Allow me. I could do that for you. Liliana, shut up. <laughs> I can do that for you. Fails. Greetings, Grey Warden. You must be under great strain with the blight upon the land. I will keep it. <laughs> because it clearly ain't picking lots. Can you elaborate more on your services? I heard there was a Grey Warden here. I am Doolin Forender, second to Lord Harrowmont, King Endrin's own choice as successor. Casual Word is murder. spreading that the surface may suffer a blight. It is shameful we are not in a better position to help. Uh, I have a treaty obliging Or Orzammar to aid against the Blight. That may be, and that is a terrible risk for the surface. But even if the world would end tomorrow, Lord Harrowmont cannot ignore Balin today. He cannot afford to trust anyone of unproven loyalties. Uh, 
I'm this is pissing me off. Stop playing games. This treaty compels you to help. You're asking the king of Orzammar to send armies to the surface, but Orzammar has no king and we have no army. Well, that right sounds now, like your the men problem. We should be fighting Darkspawn or brawling in the street. If this situation is not resolved, we face civil war. If you want Lord Harriman's time now, you'll have to prove you have no intention of turning against him later. So you would make the whole world wait. If you wish to show you have no loyalty to Balin, then work against him in Harriman's name. Balin is hosting a proving today, supposedly to honor his father's memory. The Deshers take it very seriously. And unfortunately, Balin found some way to blackmail or intimidate House Harriman's best fighters into stepping down. You want me to find out why your fighters dropped out? That would be enlightening. Though I hope you won't pry too deeply into things they don't wish revealed. If you wish to show your loyalty, enter the proving as his lordship's champion. With your order's reputation, I've no doubt the ancestors would favor your arm. Balin would never work with anyone who humiliated him in that way. Aramont would have no fear of meeting with you then. I don't want to start picking sides. Then I'm afraid your only choice is to wait until there's a winner. Lord Harrowmont cannot risk his life working with someone of unproven loyalties. If you change your mind, let me know. The proving is this afternoon, and Lord Harrowmont could certainly use you on his side. Okay. So I wasn't paying enough attention uh, in that opening cutscene to realize which of them was the douchebag. That's why I didn't want to throw in right now with the, literally the first one I came across. Because um, I had forgot huh. who's who. That dude was nice enough. I mean, as I saw it. But I want to visit the other side and make sure that uh, I don't accidentally choose the jerk News side just because hour. he's got a nice front Support name. Lord Haramont at your own peril. Darkspawn will overrun Orzammar within the year if he becomes king. Experts say... Print a newspaper, dude. Don't yell, you know, yell it in my ear like that. This is over, I wouldn't mind. All right, the Royal Guard, blah, blah, blah. Welcome to the Royal Palace. No one lives here because there's no king. Oh! Tunneling thief. <laughs> Putting down a spell beam. Or at least I was going to try to. And I'm off. Whoops. Uh. Oh, I think since this is on easy, there's no friendly fire anymore. Yeah. Suck fire, you stupid thieves. Finished. What's going on? Fight. All right. Yeah, I kept you from getting robbed. You're welcome. You caught them in the act. I guess desperate times drive people to strange things. Uh, you can get catch thieves most of the time. Regardless of whether things are good or not. Um, let's see. After all, Dutch is just looking for the right score. Let's see what's Going. in here. Um, nothing in here. Yeah, the man with the plan. Don't you worry. I've got a plan. Uh, not pale room. Physical resistance. That sounds good for Alistair. But not for me. I shouldn't be on the front lines. I'm a maid. Eliana! You gonna tell me you can't do this too? Good. Love letter. Note between wealthy paramours. Okay. And I'm off. 
Hey, you don't mind if I rooted through the royal palace, did you? Oh, that's right. There's no king here. Ah -ha! You losers don't have a ruler. All right. Greetings. What's up? What is this? And why is this door so guarded? No one enters the prince's estate without an invitation. Here I am. Oh, she can't unlock that either. Crap. Our way. Although I'd imagine it would have like instantly pissed them off if I tried. I definitely want a quick save first, but... Interesting. You plan on streaming it? Prey is kind of a game I've been looking at, um, but it seems story-based, so I've kind of been, like, trying to avoid spoilers on it. That's why I didn't come by your stream today. It's hard whenever you have a group of, like, streamer buddies who are all interested in the same type of game, because I try not to, I, I try not to spoil things for myself. So, like, when, when Noob was streaming Red Dead, I knew I was going to play it, um, so I, like, anytime he went to a cutscene, I'm like, MUTING! Yes. That sounds cool. Warden, welcome. It is always a blessing for Orzammar to host your order. I am Vartag Devorn, top advisor to our good Prince Balin. What news do you bring? Uh, let's see. You know who I am? It would be hard not to notice the Grey Warden and his eclectic entourage. I hear you seek the aid of Orzammar's finest. I need aid against the Blight. Yes, the Treaty. I've seen it in the Shaper's libraries. Now the difficulty is that the Treaty only compels our King, and we are sadly lacking one of those right now. Interesting. Let's see. Uh... Battling the Blight is more important than politics. No one wishes this fight over more than Balin. But while it rages, Orzammar can spare no one to combat what may or may not be a new Blight. I think I do. Hang on. Let's see what this is. And Bob, thank you for the prime sub. I think Shut up. I'm not here to rehost Twitch. Uh uh Carter. Yeah, I'm not doing Red Dead online. What's it called? The Twitch Prime Cultist Simulator. Oh, I have to see what this is. Cultist Simulator. Interesting. Twitch desktop app. I already have that. Interesting. I didn't know Twitch was distributing games. I I very rarely spend time on that tie to, on that side of the fence. Okay, that sounds hilarious. Uh, let's see. Blah, blah, blah. No one wishes to fight over while it rages. Or mark and spare. No one to combat what may or may not be a new blight. Excuse me? There is a blight happening. I swear it. Whoa, whoa. I'm going to go with this one. Are you implying a Grey Warden wouldn't recognize a blight? I believe you. But what are we to do? If Balin followed his heart and sent his men to aid you, Haramont would steal his throne. Oh. We would defeat the blight. And return to find our homeland devastated by an incompetent tyrant. Uh-huh. And if you don't fight, your homeland gets destroyed. Perhaps you could prove to Prince Balin your intentions are just. If you show you owe Haramont no fealty, I'm sure Balin would help you. Haramont has engaged in a campaign of bribery and coercion to ensure that every house serves him. But if a neutral party... A stranger were to approach certain key members, perhaps with irrefutable evidence of Haramont's deception. I'm certain my Lord Prince would show his gratitude. <sighs> yeah, I'm sure. What kind of... Uh, I'm not doing Balin's dirty work. Very well. 
But do not expect my prince to see you as anything more than another ignorant surfacer. I will be here if you change your mind. Oh, I gotta go back to Haramount. This is... I have the made my decision. assembly is in session. Enter quietly if you wish to observe. Alright, uh... Give me just a, a few minutes AFK, I'll be right back and we'll keep going, but... I'm pretty sure I've already made my decision here. One of them treated me with respect, and one of them... Went, 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 treated me like a jerk. So... That's how it goes. Alright, I'm back. Your mind has gone to dust if you think we would pass such a writ. Half our houses would go broke without the surface trade. The proposal is only effective until we have a king to ensure we are respected by the surfacers. Leaving you conveniently positioned to take over all contracts. I'll see your head on a pike first. Deshers, lords and ladies of the assembly. I've already doubled the guard to prevent violence. Must I summon more? Steward Bandalore. Balin's sympathizers are tying our hands with trivialities. They may as well open us to the sky. I suggest we put the matter to a vote. And I suggest you have a taste of my family's mace. Enough. Whoa. The assembly is in recess That's until rude. the members can regain control Glad of their hear emotions. That. Yeah, so this was the nice guy, I thought. Bandalore? Stone forsaken fools and dusters. I'm sorry. This is the assembly of the clans. Only dashers and occasional guests of state are allowed in. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I was muted. It is stink bug or something? I, f I forget what it is, but it's stink bug. Um, ugh. you don't recognize a Grey Warden? Forgive me. I am so exhausted. I completely oh. forgot about the message from the Gate Guard. Welcome to Orzammar, Warden. Oh. I hope you can forgive our unrest. The loss of our king has hit us hard. Respect for your role is great. But you won't receive a proper hearing until we have a king on the throne. Um, a blight is coming. Troubling, but it will still seem distant compared to the empty throne. The assembly is blind to all else. And uh, evidently everyone else is blind to it except you. How can I elect you? You seem like the only, like, reasonable person here. Does the city not care the world is about to end? This is their world, and it ended when Endrin died. Yeah. Is there any way I can break the stalemate? I must admit, Warden, I am at a loss myself. It lies with Prince Balin or Lord Harrowmont, and they are slow to trust anyone in these uncertain so times. So I still need to meet Balin. I only wish there was more I could do for you. Dang it, man. I thought this was going to be one of the two who was, like, running for king or whatever it is they were they're doing i was like i want to vote for you you're at least reasonable and nice but no the only reasonable one is friggin uh, fine be like that all right so this is where that keeper of memories or whatever it is Ooh, another nug 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 All right, you're the shaper. Thief! Who would dare take from the memories? Uh, you okay? Warden, I'm outraged. A thief in the shaperet. What have we been reduced to? Did you get a good look at him? I did. He was I bald, did. with the most garish brand across his head. Almost like he took pride in being castless. Imagine. Ah, he's probably in the slum somewhere. As if he'd find a buyer for a stolen tome in Dust Town. They couldn't know the value. I know, right? Could you define those terms for me, though? Just, you know, make sure we're all on the same page. 
Of course not. That would be helpful, Orta. Oh, um, pardon me. Were you looking for a particular volume? Not that I could really help. I, um, don't know the libraries very well. Yeah, I'm looking I'm for, uh, C-sharp for dummies. Do you have that here? What kind of research? I was looking for something about the Orton Taig. It was lost during the last blight, and there aren't many records left. They were a noble house once, descended from the Paragon Orton, who composed the grand epic of the Seven Brothers and the Ortonic Symphony. My mother's family believes they were descended from Kalana Orton, who was training in Orzammar when the Taig fell. I'm even named for the house, Orta. Unfortunately, any records would be buried in the Taig's ruins, somewhere in the deep roads. What would you people have done if I hadn't come around? I'm a Grey Warden. I'm not afraid of the deep roads. A Grey Warden? Mother always said that if anyone could find the Tyg, it was the Wardens. I hear Prince Balin and Lord Harrimont have both been sending out small teams these days. Yes, if you can find the Tyg in any records, that could do it. That could prove I'm a noble. If you could. Maybe now that you're looking. It's almost too much to hope. Huh. Shaper. When I last walked this hall, Endrin was king and Orzammar was at peace. The memories often speak of the swiftness with which change of the I mean, but it is different to see it firsthand. I apologize, Warden. I should not burden a stranger with such thoughts. I am Zebor, the Shaper of Memories. Uh, how do you know who I am? The Grey Warden's visit has been recorded in the memories, along with all who accompany you. That was fast. Uh, I thought bureaucracy to move slower than that. Um, I would like your permission to open a chantry here. That is an odd request, especially for one so new to our city. Uh, let's see. Uh, I come on behalf of Brother Burkle, a cleric of Radcliffe. Of Radcliffe. I thought so. This is I not the first so. time he's made this plea. My answer to Brother Burkle hasn't changed. So I ask you the same. On what basis would you have me insult the ancestors and overturn 2,000 years of tradition? I'm starting to, uh, let's see, cunning. Let's go with persuade. What harm would it do to let him preach? He seems a charitable man, but that is a thin thread in which to tie Ozamar's traditions. Very well, he may hold a prayer meeting as he requested, if not build a new temple to his god. At least the words would come from one of our own. Now, is there anything more? Um... Uh... Tell me some of Orzammar's history. We were a great empire once, outnumbering even humans and elves. Have a we good look, Anty. We traded with your Tevinter Imperium, and our land stretched as far in the deep roads as theirs did above. Cal Chirac was capital then, but we lost too many battles. We lost our golems, and we lost our territory. Now the empire is simply ruined tunnels filled with darkspawn. There's your problem. Uh, how did you lose your golems? The Paragon Caradon, a smith of unsurpassed genius, invented the golems. For years they were our weapon against the Darkspawn. One golem is worth a dozen dwarves in battle, but Caradon's tig is far into the deep roads. When it fell, we lost his secret to creating golems. There are books about it along these walls if you would read more. Maybe you should archive the things that actually matter. What's a tig? They are to us what a colony is to surfacers. Okay. Uh, where is Kal Shirak? At the other side of the old empire. During the last blight, the kings of Orzammar knew they couldn't hold everything. They sealed the deep roads, abandoning everyone still trapped in far-flung settlements. It was the only way to survive. Kal Shirak is the only other city to outlast the blight. We only rediscovered them recently. And they still haven't forgiven us. Okay. Uh, well, I. what are the deep roads? They were once our highways beneath the mountains. Now the Darkspawn claim them and few venture there. Except your order, who enter the deep roads when they retire, so they can die slaughtering as many Darkspawn as possible. Okay. Uh, let's go back to my first question. Please, speak your mind. Didn't I need to talk we were to him about something else? We were a great empire once, outnumbering even humans and elves. We traded with your Tevinter Imperium, and our land stretched as far in the deep road. Yeah, 
but we lost too many battles. We lost our golems, and we lost our territory. I guess Your I've already gotten everything I wanted. in the memories. Okay, quest updated. So I don't need to talk to him again. And there's nothing back here for me to talk to. Ooh, but there is a locked chest. Mm -hmm. Gloves of diligence. Uh, gloves of diligence, rather. Search for the true prophet. I'm gonna take those. I don't think Alistair has, has the strength for me to put that on, but let me have a look. Nope. Man, I need to bump up his strength pronto. Alright, Gilius, let's get going. Uh, all right, so I okay. I thought I was about to get interrupted by some cutscene. We've already run into them. Where is Prince Balin's place? I never got to talk to him. It's just that weird dude in front of the assembly who's like. Psst. Want to Lord help us. Balin's impending marriage to a castless proves his dedication to change. No dwarf is without worth. He has been heard to say. Yeah, maybe he should say that himself. To Lord everyone. Balin is a bad, bad man. Yes, very bad. Solid, dude. Solid work. All right, I got two nugs for that guy, <laughs> Nug Wrangler. Okay. Why are my loads so slow? Weird. I've got this game loaded on an SSD. What's taking so long? Commoner Garen. Where's that Nug Wrangler? Is that you? Yeah, there you go. I'm out of the Nug game. Got nothing to sell. What? I've got Nugs for you. Saraka, I'm back in the game. Such as it is. I don't have much besides gratitude, but find a bunch more of these and I'll toss you whatever I've found. I don't want... Uh, well, 12 silver's not bad. You're the best Wrangler I've ever seen. But there's more out there. Says the Nug Wrangler. I trust Vala, my Nug Wrangling. This no doubt leads out to the deep roads, the ancient passages that once led to the other dwarven kingdoms. What's up, Nug Nug? Alright, so... I'm gonna try here to see if I can run into Prince You're Valen again. Wrangler. But if I can't, um, I'm just gonna throw in with or what I've face? ever seen but there's more out there oh and I haven't visited dust town either man this place is huge nug where does this go proving grounds okay where there's another nug these suckers are everywhere they're like rabbit dogs they are kind of cute. <laughs> For vermin, I guess they are. Enchantment? Mm hmm. Haven't been in here. You're back? But it takes two weeks and four days minimum to make the journey to the Circle Tower. Sorry. Why do I get the feeling charting routes to the Circle Tower Have a good is dinner. one of her favorite hobbies? I'm guessing you haven't left yet. Uh, I'm not leaving until this election is resolved. Well, I've waited 19 years. Another month won't kill me. Atta girl. And I'm off. Oh, let me guess. You also lost something along the Dusk Roads or whatever? Welcome to Janar Family Armors. I must say, you look like our type of people. I'm Looking not a dwarf, if that's mail. what you mean. At Janar's, we have everything from leather to platinum. Platinum? 
What's happening with the king? I stay out of politics. It's not good for a smith to get the attention of those who grant vendors licenses. Atta boy. Lord Harriman's a fair man. My father did business with him, and he always paid on time. But the Idukans have served us well. If it is the ancestors' wisdom to keep them on the throne, I cannot object. Are you part of the Smith cast? I, for a hundred generations. My father made his name by inventing a fold and tacit, which were integrated into the cuirass. But, uh, I'm guessing by your face, you're not a Smith yourself. <laughs> you have guessed correctly. You have a daughter named Dagna. I, has she been bothering you? Gets a whiff of surface stink, and she's like a cave tick. <laughs> Uh, she wants to become a mage. Ah, oh, that girl. I've been telling her for years to give up those foolish notions. Magic's a human trick. If Dagna wants enchantment, I can apprentice her to a lyrium crafter. I'm sorry she bothered you. Uh, it's no bother. I'd like to help her study with the mages. Do you even know what that means? If Dagna goes to the surface, she forfeits her caste. She'll never be able to marry or, or work in Orzammar again. Dwarves don't do magic. Dagna knows that. It's just the childhood fantasy that dies hard. Please, if you see her, send her back and let me talk some sense into her. Oh, dear. Please, don't encourage Dagna further. Tell her you were wrong and that her place is with her family. Let's see what you've got. Of course. Uh, keep in mind, we also take items on trade. Okay. Well, we can sell some of this crap. Do you sell increased inventory? No. Oh, that's nice, actually. Uh, let me see. There. Oh, that's very nice. Um, better shield, but he can't use it. He can't use this, or that, or this, or that, or... Good lord, dude, come on. This is good. Four gold. For point two armor. Probably find better on the dust road. Um, okay. This, this is much better, but he can't use it. Nice. Oh, better with that. All right, you have nothing I want, so I'm just gonna sell crap to you. Um, you can have this topaz. Enchantment. Enchantment. Have you that demonic icker? Good. Uh, I'm gonna hold on to this. I think that can go away. This can go away. Yep. Bye. I'm gonna hold on to the crap that I think I can make potions out of. I'm still looking for a dude that sells flasks, but, uh. Yes. I'm gonna hold on to the, like, herbalism type stuff. So, I'm not going to ruin this poor girl's dreams, I think. I don't know, though. It's not like I'm... Am I really going to go back to the maid tower and talk to them about her? You're back? But it takes two weeks and four days men. Why do I get the feeling... I'm guessing you haven't left yet. Okay. Why are you so interested in magic, anyway? Here in Orzammar, we're surrounded by stone and tradition and more stone. Nothing ever changes. But to break every natural law by thinking about it, to dream and walk in a realm where everything you think comes true, I can't imagine anything more wonderful. Um, I should get going. I'll be waiting. I'm going to talk to them in the tower about her, I think. We've got a quest here. Brother Burkle. Oh, right. I did that. Jenner armor has been there. I don't think I went down to Dust Town. Andraste teaches that patience is the child of wisdom, but I'm eager to hear if you've seen the Shaper. Yes, he agreed to let you hold the prayer meetings. Oh, praise the Maker! You truly walk in the light, friend. 
I already found a convert among the merchants who offered his shop as a temporary chantry. It's just by the tapsters. Please, come to our first service. Nah, I'm good. Enchantment! I really ought to save and restart the game. I think it Let might... me guess. This is where the poor people live. Uh, I think that's a pretty solid guess myself. I'm going to quick save and then restart the game. Because I think it's starting to memory leak here pretty hard. Given its loading speed. One sec. Boop, boop. At least it's fast to do that. I don't want to crash on me at the end of the stream with like a bunch of unsaved progress. Resume! See? That was much faster. Uh, let's see. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. So that's what we're going to. That's what we're doing. We're going to fight. A rich Let's one. Wipe them out we'll get quickly. plenty for their kid once we put them out of here. No, don't attack Leliana, dang it. Another battle, I see. Fools! That ought to do the trick. That's a lot of blood. Okay. Rogue. Who are you? You don't look like any guardsman I ever saw, and that's not much of a uniform. Uh, I just killed those dudes. Uh, that sounds like a man was. Uh, I'm. I'm gonna use my persuade option. I'm Gilius, a Grey Warden. Oh, you looking for a chance to bring in some coin? Could be. I have that opportunity, especially for someone with a few connections above ground. What is it you're looking for me to do? Uh, no offense. But your kings have some laws that don't make sense in a practical kind of world. Like about Most who gets to do. buy and sell Lyrian. The sacred gift the stone provides us to show her love. No law should regulate that. The laws are meant to keep mages away from the stuff, so there's always buyers in the Circle Tower. I got one man named Godwin. He's expecting a delivery of a stone's weight. You want an investment opportunity? Uh, I could see fit to, say, sell you that lyrium instead at the reasonable price of 50 sovereigns. You can keep it, or, since you can travel freely from here, sell it to Godwin, who you know is buying. And uh, if you bring back his return order, I could pay you, uh, say, 20 sovereigns as a finder's fee. So... I don't want to be your smuggler. And uh, what is the conversion of sovereigns to shroot bucks? Enchantment. Enchantment. Smuggling is illegal. I'm turning you in. I don't think so. Boys! Time for more practice. Oh, yeah. We're doing this. Smuggle this. Going. I'll take that, and I'll take this. Ooh, 20 gold, heck yeah. 
screw doing your quest, I'll just kill you. There we go. Quest this. Alamar's Emporium. What are you looking for? We got nothing to buy for the likes of you. Or maybe you wanted to sell. Is that Clancy Brown? This doesn't look like a store. Well, our business is kind of covert, if you know what I mean. It's illegal in Orzammar for me to engage in protected trade, but they look the other way if I share things with my friends for money. I can't tell if it's Clancy Brown or not. I'm kind of leaning towards the no, but it's really close. I have some spare equipment. What do you give me? Why don't you take a look? Do you friggin' sell... Grab triggers, don't care. Oh, uh, arrows. Okay, let's have a look. At level. Ooh, she can use that. Yes, definitely buy that. Uh, gloves, boots. What about these? These are good for a gold. Yeah, I'll take it. Same thing. Senior Enchanter's robes. Might be good for me or Morrigan. Definitely be good for me. What's Morrigan got on? Hers is better than mine. I'm taking it! Sorry, war paint, blah, blah, blah. Bards. Secrets of, Orle of the Orlesian Bards. Isn't that what Liliana is? Should I not buy this? It looks like I should buy this. I'm gonna buy it. Specialization unlocked. Wait, but I thought that's what she already was. Uh, skills? What? Well, crap, man. Did I do a stupid? I might have done a stupid. Spells and talents. Uh, nope. Uh, character record. She's already a bard! I think I did a stupid. I am too smart! I am too smart! Enchantment? I am too smart! I am too smart! S-M-R-T! I mean, S-M-A-R- <sighs> Whatever. Doesn't look Baldi, like I pass can me a sensor bean. What, do you think I'm just giving these away? Fantastic. Because I'm not. <clears throat> Dirty dishwasher or birthday cake? Ooh, it's birthday cake. You're back. You got more business for me? No, I'm just leaving. That's what I thought. Yo, watch that tone. I gotta admit, the birthday cake bean is not bad. All right, that's not a thing. Who's this? Spare a bit for the needy. Zerlinda. Have you a coin to spare, my lord? It's for my son. He's sick. He hasn't any clean clothes to wear or anything to eat today. Neither have I. Why doesn't your son's father help you? A question I ask every day. He was eager enough for a daughter who would bring him into the mining caste. But since the boy was born, I've not seen Nose or Heal of the Lout. And me alone <laughs> on the street, forbidden to return to my family unless I... But no, I can't bear to even think of it. He's got some pretty huge lips, man. Um, what does your family want you to do? My son's father is castless, as is he. I used to be a miner, but my parents stripped my caste and refused to accept me back. Unless I agree to abandon the child in a deep Her road and pretend huge. I never bore him. Okay, uh, maybe I could reason with your family. Y you would do that? But why? Because it would cost me less money. Don't, lift a, don't look a gift warden in the mouth. Then I cannot offer enough gratitude. But I warn you, my father is a stiff-necked man. His name is Ordell, and he's usually at Tapster's in the evening. Okay. I do not think he will listen to you. 
But I will wait anxiously to see if you can do what you promise. I haven't promised anything. I just told you I would talk to him. The slums household. Uh... You guys don't mind like I feel bad coming to the slums and like stealing their crap, but I'll do it. Ah, you guys can take the experience. That's all I care about. Unless you've got anything good and then take it. Ooh. Yep, you've got something good, I'm taking it. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Uh -huh. And I bought her, yeah. I bought her some gloves too. Boom. There we go. Level up Morgan. And we'll do willpower, magic, willpower, and I don't see why she's got points in dexterity. I'll give her constitution. Okay, what do I want to do with her? Um. Let's do willpower. That's only for her, though. Plus, kind of seems like I should probably do weakness. Sounds like it'd be a good one. Tactics. Enchantment. Horrible fix. I mean, I get what you're coming from, but you're still horrible. Okay. So I don't know where this girl's father is. Oh, that's right. She said he was in tappers. Alright, that's the girl I don't want to talk out of her dreams. Like, if she wants to go and be a mage, you go and be a mage. I'll go talk to the mages for you. I'm not going to let that, her father, like, friggin' talk her into not doing what she wants. Enchantment? Enchantment, indeed. Here's some more nugs you're the for best you. Wrangler I've ever, you're the best You're the. You're. I, I trust Vala, my nug wrangling friend. I will give wow. you your money back I'm if so you agree to have never the to call me that to get again. Useless crap for you over and over. That is kind of how it feels sometimes. Uh, I passed tapsters like right away. Dang it! I thought it was over on this side. Oh well. This. Okay. Yay! Experience. So. I never got to meet that other dwarven dude. But it seems to me... I probably ought to throw him with Haramar or whatever the frick his name is. What are you looking at, stranger? I met your daughter! I have no daughter. Could be you met a castless whore claiming she was once mine. If you don't take Zerlinda back, she'll die. What? You think she'd die just to keep that thing? She knows what she has to do to come home. I never wanted her gone. Enchantment? Just a cur. Can't she see she'd have a better life if she got rid of it? He's a baby, not a cur, and she loves him. Could you pretend your child never existed? I've been trying. It's not as easy as I thought. Look, just tell her... We never meant to hurt her. It just seemed best that... Oh, just tell her to come home. Her mother and I are waiting for her. There you go. That was a fairly a fairly uh, easy, convincing job. Go down to the poor area. Go tell her that she can go home and she doesn't need to beg for money with her massive lips anymore. There you go. You can go home now. You're back. 
I thought you weren't Speaking coming. of, where's what the kid? What did he say? Your father wants you to both come home. Both of us? I don't believe he said that. I've never heard him refer to my son as anything but trash. He calls him it. But maybe. Maybe mother convinced him. Or you did. Enchantment? Oh, my friend. I cannot thank you enough. If this were a story, my son would grow to manhood and pledge himself as a knight in your service. When he grows up, I will send him to you. I promise. Can I get over that? I can't get over that girl's massive lips. I'm so glad I don't have to talk to her anymore. You know, what? whenever you talk to one of those people who has like... Um, like a mole on their face and like a really inconvenient spot and it's just like some something wrong that's just so glaring like you can't help but not stare at it that's kind of how i felt about that girl's massive lips it's so distracting i can't focus on what she's saying. <laughs> like her it was like her lips took up like 30 percent of her face Julia Roberts' lips are not that big. It's just one of the, like, I can't, I can't, I can't overlook that. Bad haircut. Oh. What you talking about, Willis? I mean, Julia Roberts does have wide lips, but I don't know. I might have to go back and compare, because I'm pretty sure her lips are not that big. Lord Balin is a bad, bad man. Yes, very bad. All right, let me double check. It is the Royal Palace... The Royal Palace is where we ran into that dude who was a jerk to us and those tunnelers. Um. All right, I'm gonna throw him with Har Haramont. He seems to be all right. <laughs> Do you see how things lie, Warden? Lord Haramont cannot trust you unproven, but he welcomes a good faith gesture. <laughs> Enchantment. Like throwing yourself in on his side in a battle to the death. Just a gesture. Uh, the Provings. Tell me about them. Wait, wait, wait. Bartag wants me to show people that Haramon is a cheat. That you spoke to him even after our discussion is not reassuring. So have you decided to earn my lord's trust, or will you throw your lot in with the snakes? I'll enter the Proving and see why the others withdrew. Excellent. The arena is located off the commons. Talk to the Proving Master and tell him you're entering Lord Haramont's roster. The key fighters we lost were Guidon and Beisel. You can look for them in the fighters' preparation chambers behind the ring. And be sure it's before the fights begin. After the first bout, no one may change the roster. If you need to find me again, I will wait in the Tapster's Tavern off the commons. There is no better place to hear gossip. Perhaps even word of your victory. Okay. What, what are these screenshots it's taking? Interesting. Okay. So we'll go back. Whoa. Uh, a Duke and Tag once home to Orgrimmar's... Uh, I think it, this isn't... Wow. Once home to Orzammar's most powerful clan, this Tag loss was a great blow to the or not seeing any of the other things up here. Okay. It'll be two years tomorrow. Enchantment? Holy sodding ancestors. How can you people just ignore that? Bronca didn't go alone, Ogren. She took the whole house. Everybody but you. So just get over to Tapsters and drown yourself already. You know as well as I do, that's how this always ends. You think I'm afraid of some cub warrior who's barely off the teach? Ha! <laughs> I'll... You lift a weapon or attack a single citizen in Orzammar, and you're stripped of your caste and exiled. Even you can't have forgotten that. 
Get out of here before I call a guardsman. <laughs> Not even a return uh, a return word. He just about faces and and walks like, yeah, I thought so. Thirty seconds, dude. I've been hearing rumor that a certain wine merchant is falling behind on his payments. I can't imagine what you mean. I pay my expenses. What about the expenses your good friend Jarvia incurs when providing your protection? It's not easy ensuring nothing bad happens. That no one decides to just burn everything in your store. Can I kill these three? Please, I don't have much. Business isn't good. People are scared. Tell Jarvie I'll get her money. I... Jarvie is not happy with your promises, old man. Now let's go inside old and man. see what you've been holding back. Yes, please, let's go inside. This is all I have right now. I could get more if I sell something. Well, well. Looks like we have a visitor. Friend of yours? Maybe you should do all your intimidation in public. You? Please, don't get involved with this. You don't know what they're like. I know what they'll and be like in about 15 seconds. Introductions. These are dangerous times in Orzammar, stranger. Lucky us, the merciful Jarvia is offering protection from the chaos. You're wearing some fancy stuff there might make you a target. So if you want the Carter's guarantee of safety, it's yours for the reasonable price of ten gold sovereigns. Or I can't say what might happen. Oh, I'll tell you what's going to happen. Take a good look. Do you really want to start this? Whoa, whoa. All right, you win. I'm not going to die for ten lousy sovereigns. You almost did. Yeah, well, how did I do? Okay, there we go. Ancestors, bless you for saving my poor store. I don't know how to express my gratitude. Gold would work. What do you know about this Jarvia? I've, I've never met her, of course. They say she never leaves Dust Town. That's uh, the older area of the city where the castless congregate. Oh, you mean where I've She's already killed ten people? This depravity. Since good King Endrin died, they're getting bolder. They used to be a problem only in Dust Town, but now they're in the commons, shaking honest men down for coin. What do you have? Uh. Uh, what do you know about her carta? What is a carta? A band of castless thugs. Ah. They're to blame for all the crime in Orzammar these days. They're criminals, and the children of criminals. The ancestors themselves declared them irredeemable. Irredeemable? Okay, the children as well, you go that far? Their births are abominations. They were born from no Kalna, with no acknowledgement by the Shapers. They are destined to be criminals. Now, if you'll excuse me, no I'm kidding. grateful for your help, but I don't think we have any more to talk about. Your sins are visited to the tenth generation. Did you have something more pleasant you wish to discuss? I'd like to see what you got for sale. I'm showing you the lowest prices I can afford. I assure you. You know when you front load that, it makes me not trust you? Just saying. Enchantment! No, I can stay on. I'm done with that conversation. But thank you. Uh, I think... I think I'm actually going to buy these. I know I can't use them yet, but no, I'm going to. Flasks! Yes! Buy them all! Wait, what? Oh. Enchantment! Jeez. I'm glad for that fact alone that I saved his butt. Lesser health. I don't want Mabari Crunch. Blump, blump, blump. And... 
Blump. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have a Mabari though. And I already, I already wasted a bunch of crap on. Pleasant you wish to discuss. I already made a bunch of them that I didn't I'm need to make you because I'm being an idiot. I can afford. Shut up. Fifty-four lesser health poultices. Yeah, I will buy that as well. Um, and I'm gonna buy another fifty flasks or whatever it is that I made of those. So nice. What do you mean by turned? Like, as in when you started to like it, or... Like, when the narrative changed. Right. That's where the deep roads are. I gotta go back to the poor quarter to talk about his friggin'... Okay. Fair enough. Not everything's for everybody. I get that. Wait. Okay, yes. Here we are. Alamar's Emporium. Which I don't believe was open before. Hmm. You're back. You got more business for me? Uh, right. This was the guy. That's what who, I thought. That's the guy who I thought was was Clancy Brown. Okay, I'll be interested to see what I think about it when I get there. Uh, like I was kind of not a fan of Dragon Age Origins when I uh, when I played it the first time. It wasn't until I streamed it that I was like, yeah, I, I see what people enjoy out out of this. Wait, crap. This is that stupid little weird little ditched house. I love... I really loved Mass Effect. There's no one here in Dust Town. Didn't he say the person shaking him down was down here? What do you want, Warden? You're out of your element down here. I'm looking for a thief who dared steal from the Shepherd. Is that so? What makes you think anyone here would turn me, I mean, this person in? You've oh, walked into oh, a oh. sodding fight, Warden, and I've already passed your stupid tome along. Too bad for you. Enchantment! This is not going to work out for you. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> We are victorious again. Yeah, well, it kind of was four against one. Proving receipt. We printed in the proving grounds. Okay. Beggar. Hey, as long as I win, I don't care what I beat them with. And as long as they're ashamed and humiliated in the end. Um, I mean, I'll be honest, um, when it comes to, if I was to compare Dragon Age against Mass Effect, I would obviously choose Mass Effect right now. I enjoy Dragon Age Origins so far, but it feels like it, it feels more of an evolution of KOTOR to me as it is than it is, um anything approaching Mass Effect. I love the Mass Effect series. Um, so it's, it's really hard for me to kind of come down and, and be, and air the two. The Tapsters, Osmar Chantry. All right, I'm going to check the imports and then I'm going to go into the proving grounds and see if we can get this, uh, story ball a rolling. I mean, ultimately though, one of the things that I'm interested in as part of my channel is collecting stories. And I know a lot of people really love Dragon Age. It's a story-based game. 
And so I thought I'd give it a shot, and if I could at least tolerate it, I wanted to see what the story was. So, Did you have are. something more pleasant you wish to but discuss? I, this has not displaced Mass Effect, though, in my opinion. Uh, what do you know about this story? I've, I've never met her, of course. They say she never leaves Dust Town. There's That's no a, one the in Dust Town. The city where the cast, she's the one directing this. Dep they used to be a problem only in Dust Town, but now they're in the commons, shaking honest men down for coin. A band of they're criminals and the children of criminals. The ancestors themselves declared them irredeemable. I should let you get back to work. Hey, you. Mother's Hope, Flame Filled a Sun Ruck, that's in the Deep Roads. Uh, you agreed to go to the Circle to ask them if Dagna can study there. I can't do that here. This is the Proving Ground stuff. Decide if you will help Prince Balin's cause. I'm not doing that. Thief didn't have the stolen tone. That's a Proving Grounds. Okay, that's also Proving Ground. So oh, good. Or no, that's Deep Roads. So let's go to the Proving Grounds. Yeah, and I can see that. Like, there were a couple of... Qu Enchantment? Now that you bring that up... I mean, there were a couple of little quests that are like, get this or pay that or whatever. But for the most part, Mass Effect's quests are all character building or character developing in some way. I never really thought about that. So, let me get this... Nope. No, it is not! Thank you, Queen. I mean, Auntie. Straight. Sorry. You were a cloistered sister? You must have been a brother before you became a Templar, no? I never actually became a Templar. I was recruited into the Grey Wardens before I took my final vows. Do you ever uh, regret guard. the Tentry? No, never. Do you? Besides yes. the fact that Mass Effect is an FPS, I'm trying to avoid the fact that this is kind of a, a strategy slash tactical game versus the FPS. I'm trying to leave that aside. I do prefer the FPS. But as it comes to stories, this one definitely moves slower. It feels less player involved, but is more complicated. So it's interesting. Yeah. All the right. Proving Grounds. Bloodsport entertainment for the masses at its best. Fantastic. All right, so we're here to throw in for one of the lords and figure out why the other two bowed out. Look, I already told the Proving Master I withdrew. Do you have to keep harassing me? Yeah, a and they became your crew. It wasn't so much as you, as you, um, leading the story as you becoming part of the story. Like, that's kind of what how I felt about, yeah, yeah, exactly. And I do have an attachment with some of these characters as well. Like, I really like Morgan a lot. But I still feel external to the story in Dragon Age Origins. Um, with Mass Effect, I felt like more integrated with Enchantment? it. Enchantment? Yeah, whatever. Um, who are you? Why, I'm Basil Harrimont, but you know that. Why else would you... Um... If you weren't looking for me, do me a favor and pretend I never said anything. <laughs> uh, who do you think I'm working for? So I take it you weren't sent here to find out if I withdrew from the Proving. In that case, never mind. If you tell me what's happening, I could help you. Look, it's just, when I was younger, I had a thing with this Idukin girl, Revelka. Lesser cousin, nowhere near the throne. Her family wanted her marrying up, so they matched her with a BMO. But we didn't exactly stop seeing each other. Um, so you're being blackmailed. Balin's fighter Miyaja showed me love letters they have, from Revelka to me. If I fight, they'll expose us. There it is. I can get those letters back. 
You do that? I don't know how to thank you. I, I know it's my own fault, but I'd have married her if I could. Yeah, I'll Aelin's totally hide you from the con the consequences you of your sure illicit love affair. You make sure she never shows them to anyone. I'll fight for Harrowmont again. But you need to find them quickly. Registrations close once the first bout starts. All right, and that's the Proving Master. So where's the other one? All right. <laughs> yeah. I don't think that applies to here. What the crap is this? Oh, those are training dummies. <laughs> For a brief second, I thought these were like dwarves on racks. That's like some kind of some kind of torture. <laughs> Allow me. I could do that for you. Really? Because you failed before. Okay. M Miyaja's chest. Oh, that's Allow also. Me. Shut I up. I could do that for you. You don't have to freaking say that every time. There's the love letters. Wow, we're just going to solve this quest right friggin' here, are we? All right. Uh, hi. Guards, remove this intruder. Guards, remove this intruder. Well, you should lock your door, dude, if you don't want me in there. That's how these games work. This is my world. You're just living in it. <laughs> Stick station. Yeah, exactly. Like, they just need them, like, going vertical vertical and rotating rotisserie style. Cooking dwarves. All right, I got your love letters. I thought there were two people who dropped out. The proving's though. almost starting. I should leave if you haven't found anything. It's been thirty seconds, dude. I have your letters right here. Where did you get those? No, 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 no. I, I don't want to know. Just glad I brought Liliana with me. I can't say what it means to know my Revelka is safe. Uh, I can never turn away a man in love. I will be glad to fight for Harrowmont in the Provings. Thank you again, friend. You got it. Um. Oh, there's another one back there. Thief in the house. Fixer. Fixer Greedon. Let's go meet ourselves a Fixer, shall we? Enchantment. Yeah, I replaced Sten with her. Sten was driving me crazy. I knew. Ah. Okay. Fixer is attacking me! Kill Fixer! Ah! Ding dong, the fix is dead! Volume of Shaper History. Cool. So that that uh, that should resolve one of the quests I found. Oh frick! Ah! Do not disturb me. I must meditate before my fight. <laughs> Do me a favor and use your awesome skills to keep me alive, you please. You looking at something? Hey, you said you told me the Witch Doctor was an important class late game. So, you should really be working on keeping me alive if you want to survive the whole run. Them's the brakes. Saying. Saying. <laughs> you new in the fights? I don't remember seeing you before. I've never fought before. <laughs> you don't get out much. I'm Gilius of the Grey Warden. It's a pleasure. Sorry, it can't be longer. Name's Guidon, and I just tendered my resignation. Somehow, I don't think the ancestors will favor me today. Oh, so what you're telling me is that I was probably dead meat regardless. Cool. Uh... Why did you resign? It's not so much what happened, as what's going to. I heard from a reliable source Lord Harriman's already given up the throne. Balin called this whole proving to let his lordship save face when he concedes. What was the name of the bad guy? Drago. Yeah. If he dies, dies. Best even Drago impression ever. What? 
Uh, that's ridiculous. Haramont isn't conceding. Oh? And where did you hear this that's more reliable than a member of the Assembly? <laughs> I still haven't gotten to watch the whole VOD yet. I want to. Uh, let's see. I don't want to lie to him. Let's intimidate. Doolin, and I'm rallying honorable fighters for Haramont. I, uh, I suppose there's nothing his lordship would do without consulting Doolin. He's always been his top that man. That was before I Maybe got there. Maybe you're right. I, I'm just a warrior. I think. I've always tried to stay out of these noble politics. If I find out this whole thing was some flunky of Balin's lying to me for his own gain, I'll... I'll... You'll go kill a bunch of people in the Proving Grounds? Excellent. Oh, there it is. Get back in the Proving and knock some heads? Maybe I will at that. Um... Enchantment! So, I did boom that moment where, like, Doc and your entire team decided to miss all the time for no freaking reason. Is that what you're talking about? Fine to see you here, Warden. A number of people have told me they hope to see you in the Provings. It's a rare opportunity <laughs> for someone so exotically that was great. trained. In fact, a few were hoping you'd take part in some informal action. That's that's why, I, like, when you got back to town, you're like, all right, Gilly, you're up. And I was like, well, crap, man. I kind of liked your team pissing you off when I wasn't on it. Now I can get blamed. Uh, let's see. Informal? You mean illegal. Assembly restricted, not illegal. All that ritual lets nobles rationalize it's not a blood sport. They don't like commoners using the arena for petty squabbles. Some of us prefer an honest spectacle. And sometimes someone needs a good beating, and all that talking gets in the way. Alright, so, hang on. I'm gonna see if this still works. Yeah. Um, I know that most of us here in the channel right now are friends, and we all follow each other and that kind of dealy, but if you're not following Fix, you really should be. Um, he, uh, runs the Outlaws, and he is currently kind of getting back into streaming with, uh, doing a Darkest Dungeon run every Tuesday night, and he likes to incorporate followers and the people in his channel as part of the team, for good or for ill, and it's definitely worth giving him a follow and watching his VOD. He's very skilled at Darkest Dungeon, he's a good guy, and he'll probably get us all killed, but, you know... It'll be an interesting journey along the way. So toss him a follow and go watch his next run. It'll be worth it. All right, let's see. Uh, and on a spectacle. Is... Wait, you just want me to beat some dude up? <laughs> you were losing your mind. It was great. Uh, let's see. Uh, not to my interest. Goodbye. I trust you'll keep the offer to yourself. Yeah, I'm not gonna help you friggin' fix the matches, dude. That's not how I roll. Not in this game. If this is Red Dead, heck yeah. I'll corrupt all you want to corrupt. <laughs> the proving will begin shortly. I'm sure you can find a place in the stands. Or were you here to take part in the fight? That sounds like, that sounds like Campbell from Metal Gear Solid. I'd like to hear more about who's fighting. I want to hear you talk some more. Well, with politics what they are, many combatants are dedicating their fights to either Prince Balin or Lord Harrowmont, mostly Balin. That's Campbell it's from- It's a regular parade of past winners out there. Piotr Naidukin always needs a battle unit. He's the prince's cousin. Miyaja and Luke John are twins from the warrior cast. They fight together, put on a good show. They'll all be in their chambers if you want to talk. Like, I, I think that's Colonel Campbell from Metal Gear Solid pitched down. It's slightly deeper, but it's got like the same intonations and inflections as Campbell. I think that's him. I'd like to fight as Lord Harrowmont's champion. Well, that's a surprise. Never thought the Grey Wardens would take an interest in our king. Let me just put you into the schedule here. Now, is there a particular name you wish listed? I am Gilius of the Grey Wardens. 
We'll just call you Grey Warden, seeing as those human names are a real bird to pronounce. We actually have an opening in the first round. Yeah, you could are call you me Goliath. Noob seemed to prefer that for a while. Uh, who will I be fighting? Looks like Suwern's drawn first bout. He was one of the youngest champions ever. Beat his own father at 12 years old. Dang. All for the right to earn his battle status two years early. Are you ready to start? What are the rules? Fight start at the gong and go to first blood. No eye gouging, Chili. no groin I cords. forgot about that one. The rules of each bout will be announced when it starts. You should be comfortable with normal weapons and lyrium enhanced weapons in single combat, pairs, or battle units. Are you ready to start? Uh, could we avoid maybe the single combat? <sighs> That's what I Whatever. like to hear. Baldy, pass me I a will sensor warn you, though. What do you think? This Butter is your popcorn right? to make preparations or meet the competition. Because I'm not. Once the fight begins, there are no new additions to the roster. Ah. All withdrawals are treated as losses and a sign of the ancestors' disfavor. Enchantment? Do you want to start or would you like some time? The fighters' quarters are behind the room. Oh. That's a really strong rotten egg. Um, hang on. I'll be, uh... Come back soon. You'll be fighting the bout as soon as both fighters are ready. Oh, oh that's terrible. All right, give me just a few minutes AFK, and then we'll get our butts in the harrowing and have some fun. Enchantment indeed. All right. Let's get our butts into the Good, harrowing, you're back. I was about to start looking for you. Are you ready to fight? Remember, I'm, I was right in front of you, begins, dude. The roster is final. No new additions are accepted, and all withdrawals are marked as losses. The harrowing is how the game began. Quit stalling. I'm ready to taste blood. Go down to the ring, then. I'll be right there. This is a glory proving. Why did that Fought not go under off? the eyes of the paragons of Orzammar to honor the memory of King Endrin. First up is Suwern of the Warrior Cast. Many of you remember when Suwern made history as a lad of twelve by defeating his own father in this very ring. Today, he fights as a champion for Prince Balin. Aramont. Opposing him in Aramont. Lord Heramont's name is a member of the famed Grey Wardens. In the name of House Idukan and our future King Balin. Idukan! You honor me with this fight. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Okay, uh, it's just me. Going. All right, I'm game. Go ahead and slap that sucker down. Be on your guard. And show him my back All at the right. same time, which is exactly what you want to do to an enemy. Show him your back. Going. I don't even care about you. Goodbye. The winner is the Grey Warden. That was an the exciting start. The mysterious stranger. So where it is rarely trounced, and so thoroughly. Are you ready for your next opponent? Who's my next opponent? Next, you're up against Miyaja and Luke John. As twins, they've always been allowed to fight as a single person. What? They're That's not cats, fair. But their mother was a smith, so watch out for Miyaja's hammer. And don't forget Luke John. Most fighters do and end up with a knife in their spine. Are you ready to begin? So what if they're like triplets or quadruplets? They just always win? Yeah, sure. Just point me to the ring. All That's right, not then. fair. I'll see you out there. This is a glory proving. Fought under the eyes of the paragons of Orzammar to honor the memory of King Endrin. This round, Paramount's champion takes on the notorious duo. The warrior cast twin terrors now fighting yeah, for Prince Yeah, but they still Balin, shouldn't get to fight Miyaja as one person. And Luke John. May the stone honor you. When you fall. Sure, and may the dirt taste good when I feed it to you. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Are either of you spellcasters? Nope. All right. Why am I just standing here? One. Oh crap. Come, Luke oh crap. John. It's time to fight! 
Why am I not doing anything? Huh. What's going on here? That was Watch your weird. Back, Bianca. Ah, we do not fear you! Let's do this quickly, shall we? What? Yes. It wouldn't let me do anything. Why would I let Go them win? Me. I've decided to just lose the game. Oh, frick. The winner is the Grey Warden! The mysterious stranger has won! Well, that was an exciting bout. Two on one, and you took them both easily. Uh, Are you ready for your next opponent? I wouldn't opponent? say easy, but you know, whatever. Who's my next opponent? Well, this bout should be quick and dirty. You'll be fighting Hanashan, one of the legendary Silent Sisters. She's a ferocious fighter, and dedicated enough to cut out her own tongue. Are you ready to begin? What? How would she do that? Oh, just point me to the ring. All right then, I'll see you out there. This is a glory proving. Fought under the eyes of the Paragons of Orzammar, Paramount's champion has held the field so far. But how will he do against one of the legendary Silent Sisters? We'll find out as the Warden faces Lady Hanashan, who proved her worth to Paragon Ashtith the Grey by cutting out her own tongue. <laughs> oh, crap. And to our Prince Balin by fighting in his name. Please say something. I so want, like all the other fighters have said something to me. But she has no tongue, so I kind of want her to be like, I'm a horrible person. Oh. Oh. Good luck to you. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Have at you then. <laughs> and I'm off. This is easier than the twins. Yes. Bye bye. The winner is the Grey Warden. Paramount will be I know. pleased, Warden. The Silent Sister support was a great boost for Baby. I knew what you meant. Are you ready for your next opponent? Who's my next opponent? This should be a good match. You'll battle Wojak Ivo, master of all weapons, prisoner of none. How can he you be a prisoner of a weapon? Never to use the same technique twice. I see. Are you ready to begin? So, jack of all trades, master of none. Got it. Point me to the ring. All right, then. I'll see you out there. This, this round is paired combat. Just as Kiachet fought as King Bloodlick II, defending our empire, so have dwarves always fought alongside a second. Master of all weapons, prisoner of none, Wojak Ivo has never Why won the same way twice. One again? What will he do today, lords and ladies? And will it win the day for Prince Balin? Grey Warden, choose your second, for you face Wojak, Ivo, and Valans. So I can fight alone, I can pull in one of my people, or I can pull in two of... Or I can pull in one of Haramont's people. I'm going to pull an Alistair. Last one standing will be declared victor. I doubt it matters too much. Fight! All right. 
way. Neither of them are mages either, so. All right. Alright, I'm gonna finish him off since he's frozen. That'll do it. I think we work well together. The winner is the Grey Warden! Wojak Ivo is one of the best this arena has seen, Warden. Haramont picked wisely. Are you ready for your next opponent? How many of these do I have to do? Who's my next opponent? This is the championship round. A full squad-on-squad -squad combat. Excellent. The Iduken leads the same team he's taken to victory in over a dozen Deep Roads expeditions. Are you ready to face the final test? Ready to win the title. May the ancestors choose wisely. This is a glory. Only two warriors remain. Fighting for his royal cousin Balin, Piotan Iduken has, no has led his team to triumph in the over every unit so far. Challenging him on behalf of Lord Haramont, the Grey Warden has risen from nothing to stand at the competition summit. Each will lead a full unit of four soldiers to see once and for all whom the ancestors favor. You fight well, but your judgment is questionable. The throne will never leave House Iduken. I got bad news. Uh, I dedicate my triumph to Haramont's victory. Last one standing will be declared victor. Fight! Fight. <laughs> you got it, buddy. Got it, you two. Whoa. Yes. There's one down. Whoa. Sometimes you forced our hand. You should run while you can. Be careful. Oh crap. Oh crap. Uh, I need to put some potions on her so she doesn't die. It's done. Crap. All right. Going. How amusing. Come on. Going. Just whittle him down. Come on. Let us end this. I'm just gonna whittle him down and heal. Yes. This guy hits like a truck. Heal me! Heal me! Holy crap! Very well. I shall do it. You cannot win! Wow. No way. Do I have to do all that again? Enchantment! That dude crit me for like 135. Crap, man. So, let me get this straight. You were a cloistered sister? You must have been a brother before you became a Templar. No? I never actually became a Templar. Thank I was you, recruited Pixel. into that the Grey That makes me Ward. feel so much better.
I hear there are all kinds of rules that govern the proving. They get very mad. All right, blah blah blah. I'll get your stupid love letters. Look, I already told the proving master I withdrew. Do you have to keep? Why? I um, if you weren't looking for me, I left the proving out. on my own business, and I have no intention. Tell me what's happening. Her family wanted her marrying up, so they matched. Do you know what that's like? Uh, now Balin found out. Was There's saved. no way to guarantee that. I appreciate the thought, but they really have. What haven't. evidence does he have? Her husband would cast her aside, and I would be lucky to be allowed to die. And get him. Balin's. But you. Ah, oh, that's so irritating. All right. So before the championship Howie. fight, I'm gonna. I'm going to take time for a rest and then save. It's so irritating. It's done. On my way. Like, they ought to have checkpoints or something, man. That's brutal. And the only thing that was in the other room was a dude who tried to ask his guards to kill me when I got there. Nothing down there. Okay. <sighs> yeah, his, his little uh, minions were not bad. But the... Uh, but the, the big dude almost starting. hits like a truck. I should leave if you haven't found anything. I got your letters. I can't say what it means to know my Revelka is then safe. Then fight. Thank you again. Uh. You. I knew. Ah, the fixer is trying to kill me again. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Coin for the uh, takes the ward. Yes. Fools. Yes. No mercy. You cannot win. Hopefully you don't fight as poorly as you smell. All right. I'll try to be merciful. Merciful. Ah, yes! That's a lot of blood. Okay, that deals with them. I believe I've got to do all this crap again. I don't think I went in here, though. Greetings. I'm Gilius of the Grey Wardens. Don't take it personally. Hanashan's a member of the Silent Sisters. She doesn't talk to anyone. Okay. Who? Uh, who are you? I am Ferindin. I serve as Hanashan's trainer and translator. How do you as translate for someone sister, with no Hanashan tongue? Hanashan cut out her tongue like the ancient paragon Astith the Grey. As you might imagine, she requires my services for more mundane tasks. Whose side are you two on? I already know that, but... The Silent Sisters support the Sitting King. Yeah, they are blah, loyal blah. servants to the Idukans. You should consider... You should reconsider who you call King. Your bravado is meaningless. When a silent sister fights, she doesn't do it with words. Don't worry, I'll kill if her If you would later. back up your claims, enter the proving. The ancestors will show who they think is worthy. Okay. I didn't go in there last time. You looking at something? Get out of here! Bunch of friendly folk, aren't you? Fine to see you here, Warden. A number of people have told me they hope to see you in the Provings. It's a rare opportunity to fight against someone so exotically trained. In fact, a few were hoping you'd take part in some informal action. No, you gotta go down to the poor district for that. Informal? <laughs> you mean illegal. Assembly restricted, not illegal. All that ritual lets nobles rationalize it's not a blood sport. They don't like commoners using the arena for petty squabbles. Some of us prefer an honest spectacle. And sometimes someone needs a good beating, and all that talking gets in the way. Okay. What did you have in mind? Say the word and I'll line up a team from one of the younger houses. They don't often get a chance to test themselves in the provings. They're a hungry bunch who employ unusual tactics. Understand that there's no concern for fairness here. Your battles will be hard won. Who am I facing and what do I get for it? The younger houses are interested in unorthodox tactics. Many hire mercenaries to augment traditional strengths. 
Anything goes is a fair description. I have yet we to hear a reward payouts. from that. Maybe a bonus from time to time. But this isn't about money. It's about skill and the chance to show it. Yeah, I'm not interested in showing my arena e -peen. I'll, I'll be come back here. later. I already have trouble... I'm already having trouble with the legitimate arena fights. You new in the fights? I don't remember seeing uh, you I'm before. Gilius. Name's Guidon. And I just tendered my Gulen resignation. Gulen asked me to talk to you. I bet he did. That man thinks nothing is beneath him. Well, you could just tell him I had my reasons. It's not so much what happened as what's going to. I heard from a reliable source Lord Harriman's already given up the throne. Balin called this whole proving to let his lordship save face when he concedes. Uh, that's ridiculous. He's not conceding. Oh? And where did you hear this that's more reliable than a member of the Assembly? Doolin, I'm fighting honorable fighters. I, uh, I sup... Maybe you're right. If I find out this whole thing was some flunky of Balin's lock... Go back and maybe some heads. Okay, so I did talk to him. For some reason, the beginning of his conversation wasn't familiar to me. Okay. So we'll go talk to him. Or I'll save and then talk to him. And we'll get this going, and then I will take a break before the championship match. And we'll continue. The proving will begin short. Or were you here to take I'd part like to in the fight? fight as his champion. Let me just... Now, is there a particular name you... Ilias. Are you ready to start? We'll be fighting. Are you ready to... Ready and eager. Once... Do you want to start, or would you like... I want to fight. This is... Today... In the name of house... You honor me, blah. Huh. And I'm off. <laughs> and I'm off. Was there any that doubt? One? The winner is. That was an. Ex Are you ready okay. for your next opponent? Who is it? Blah, blah, Are blah. you ready to begin? Point oh. me to the ring. When you fall. May the turf face good. Blah blah blah. Let's wipe them out quickly. Huh. We fight as one. Ah. All right. Uh. Okay, it's not giving me the problems fighting them this time. If you insist. Ah, look over Together, there. we are unbeatable. <coughs> ah. This is heal. Ah. Huh. Yeah, exactly. Ah, yes. Oh. The winner is... Are you ready for your next opponent? What is it? Uh, she, are you ready to begin? Just point me. Level and back. to... Good luck to you. Time for more practice. Quick! Okay. Uh. Eat flame. Huh. And get frozen. Going. And then you die. Next! The winner is... Harem, are you ready for your next opponent? Who is it? This should be a good match. He are you ready to begin? Let's all do right. it. This Matt Gray Warden, choose your second. For um, you face vote. I'm gonna choose Last. Alistair again. And none of them was a maid, so I can do that. Alright. Are you joking? Sure yeah. you're joking. Down you go! And they're dead. The winner is. Okay. Well, Jack Ivo is. Are you ready for your next opponent? Who's this one? This is. P okay. Are you ready to face the final? Give me a little time. Combat? And save. Save. There we go. Good. You're back. Now we can are try you, again. The crowd is eager to see another. Vi go down to the ring then. This. Eat. You fight well, but your judgment is questionable. I dedicate my triumph to Harriman's victory. Me. Last one standing will be declared victor! <coughs> fight! Yes. But without redoing an, an hour and a half's work of work, or an hour and a half, half an hour's worth of work. I'm gonna stay back on this one. Over me. Defend huh. yourself! Run while you can! 
a bit more dialogue. Let's make this quick. Huh. Let's make this quick. Make a preserve us. You should run while you can. Yeah. Mana. I need mana real bad. Yes. If I can keep Alistair alive, we'll be all right. I never like this part. Oh. You lost me and you right. should pay. That's all it is then. Let's do this quickly, shall we? Good. Oh, frick. I need to heal Alistair. Okay, good. Now it's just this guy and everyone's still alive. It's your time to die. So I just need to keep Alistair alive and we'll be all right. There's that heavy hit. Oh crap, All I still right, got a little one alive here. And Morgan's dead. Great. Now this should be fun. This back. Push huh. them back. And Alistair is dead. Come on. And I'm off. Let's make this quick. Ah! Oh. Oh. He hits like a truck, man. He really does. Um, healing. I'll do it. Oh, oh you a funny one, you are. Oh. Enough. Oh. Huh. Come on. Mana. Stay still. Oh, lovely. Quick! Back! Oh. Frick! Oh. Ouch! Now that will hurt! Come on, don't let him take a heavy swing at you! Okay, and hit him again! Oh. Yeah! The winner is That's the it. Grey Warden. Oh. Congratulations! You defeated the man Prince Trian himself once called the Horns of My Army. Do you deny this Grey Warden has earned the championship? Then it is my honor to declare this Grey Warden champion of the proving who has shown that the ancestors favor Lord Heramont. May the assembly heed the ancestors and choose Heramont. I hope I didn't make a wrong choice here. The ancestors speak through you. Congratulations, Warden. But I don't think I have. The other dude was working through, like, blackmail and crap. That's not how I run things. You showed him. The ancestors are smiling on Lord Haramont today. Yeah, it's a good thing you helped me. Although I could have called on him and I didn't. Oh, that was stressful. That was an excellent showing. We were honored by your participation, Warden. Well, you're welcome. Nothing else down there. All right. So now what? Blah, blah, blah. Lost in the memories. Thief in the house. First task. Return to Doolin Ferender. In the Tapster's Tavern to tell him the good news. Alright. Tapster's is right over here, if I recall correctly. Nope. Wrong side. There it is. Alright, so we'll probably call... Uh, we'll probably go ahead and turn I this in and then call wonder, it a night. Alistair, if you will indulge me. Do I have a choice? Of the two of you that remain, are you not the senior Grey Warden here? I find it curious that you allow another to lead while you follow. I'm the player You find here. that curious, do you? In fact, you prefer <sighs> to a new Whatever. recruit. Baldy, pass me a sense of me. Food or what, you food? Giving these away? what do you want to hear? That I prefer to follow? Dog food. 
I do. You sound so very defensive. Couldn't you crawl into a bush somewhere and die? That would be great. Thanks. I really enjoy Alistair and Morgan's uh, banter. It's dog food, by the way. Going. Okay, so we'll go turn that in and tell him, great, you're going to be king now, or whatever. Oh, this is his right-hand dude. Atrasvala, champion. I hear your performance in the Proving was nothing short of amazing. I must thank you for bringing both Beisel and Guidon back into the fight. Oh, were they his in the fight? Was I didn't to notice. His old friends stand for him. There can no longer be any doubt where your sympathies lie. If you're ready, Lord Haramont will see you now. Oh, really? Excellent. Lead the way. His lordship is looking forward to meeting you. You mean the future king? Enchantment! <laughs> oh, now that I've actually earned him the kingship is when I get to meet him? You'd better not be a douchebag, dude. Wait, is... I appreciate what you have done, Warden. And I apologize for putting one of your rank through such trials. I am Lord Pyrell Harrowmont, and I thank you for your efforts to help me preserve King Endrin's throne. I am too smart! I am too smart! I am too smart! I am too smart! S-M-R-T! I mean S-M-A-R- Why would Endrin prefer you over his own son? You may not know the story, but Balin is actually the youngest of three. Endrin's eldest, Trian, was murdered in the Deep Roads not a year ago. His middle son was found standing over the body and was exiled. But I've always found it suspicious that Balin knew just where to look. Endrin loved his sons too much to voice such suspicions. But he knew Balin's only interest in ruling was to further his own power. Uh, let's see. Balin's men say you planted those suspicions. Uh, I don't want, like, after I've done all this, I don't want to be like, well, I'm having second thoughts. Um, you believe you'd be a better king than Balin? I have never sought the throne. My role was to serve Endrin, first as his advisor, then as an elected desher in the assembly. A Haramont has never been king. And I always assumed Trian would rule after his father. But both Endrin and my colleagues have asked me to step up. And I will not back down when Orzammar needs me. Um, I frequently kind of have the personal uh, feeling that a lot of people who desire power don't deserve it. So I kind of subscribe to this the way he's thinking about this, like, because Balin is working to to obtain so much power, he shouldn't have it. So I'm, I, th what I'm hearing here tells me that uh, I've made the right choice. The assembly has more power than the king. Eh. The assembly represents the voices of the wisest, most noble families. While we need a single king to preside over important functions and lead us in battle. The assembly better represents all in Orzammar. Well, it's just the way that I see it is that people who deserve to have power have responsibility put upon them um, by the people who respect them. Um, it's the people who are like, yeah, give me all the power. I want to be able to do whatever I want. Blah, blah, blah. Like, those are the ones who are just like, I don't want to trust you with that. That's, that's my opinion on it. There are some exceptions, as as usual. Not everyone is like that. But it's just, you know... Oh, gotcha. Um... Assembly better represents all in all. All I want is your support against the Blight. For us, the Darkspawn are a constant menace. So a Blight may not elicit the same urgency you are used to. Ultimately, the Assembly decides what troops to send. If they no longer fear civil war, they'll have no reason to hold back. I thought we if just dealt with that. If you want my support to count, I will have to be king. And right now, 
There is no sure way to get there. It, what Have you did heard I of just a woman do? Named Jarvia and the criminal Carter she runs? Yeah. Yeah, the gang of Castless, yes. The assembly receives pleas every day from the common folk, begging that something be done about her. So far, no one has managed. Jarvia hides her base in Dust Town, the raw edges of the city. That explains no why it wouldn't let me look at that when I went down criminals. there before. If you would help me in this, it would show the assembly that I, and not Balin, have the ability to defend and rule this city. I'll deal with I'll deal with Jarvia. Be ready to help against the blight. Do this, and I promise, if I take the throne, I will not stop until the assembly sends your troops. Look for Jarvia in Dust Town. Do whatever it takes to see that justice is served. Okay. So I think this is probably going to be a good place for me to call it a night. I've been streaming for a while anyway. Um...